Hey guys, good morning. Um, I'm at the dog park, if you can see dogs way over there. And I'm recording from my uh, iPod. Um, Surfer's owner, I hope you can hear me. Surfer's owner got sick and he said, can you take him out for an hour today? And I was like, sure. So I brought him to the dog park because I know it was only like a 15 minute walk. I figured he could spend like half an hour here. And I let him loose, he starts running around. He gets a little rough. Uh, not aggressive and I guess people are scared of him because he's a pit bull so he gets a little uh, rough and there's another dog a boxer who was dominating him and they started growling at each other it wasn't it didn't get crazy or anything but they growled at each other and uh, we, the guy pulled them away well he pulled surfer away it looked like he was gonna like beat the shit out of surfer but I got in there and um, well the guy not the boxer and uh, so, Surfer, easy. So, you know, I grab Surfer, I put him on his leash, I calm him down, and then this lady comes over to talk to me with her dog, and I let Surfer go again after like five minutes, and he gets all aggressive with the lady's dog, and she gets all freaked out. So I grab Surfer, and I pull him out, and I can't believe he's this aggressive. Like, he was genuinely aggressive. He didn't just start biting other dogs or anything, but he got a little aggressive, like, growling, and he's a pit bull, so people are scared of him already. Easy. He's getting, he wants to go, but I'm not going to let him back in if he's going to be this aggressive. And he's running around like crazy, so I can't grab him to go because he's not trained yet. I don't think he's ever been to a dog park. And uh, I look cool, by the way, don't I? Oh, and I just got a text from, from my friend Jessica, who you guys are going to meet on Friday. Yay! We're going to go watch Breaking Dawn. Hopefully it's not sold out. We're going to go at 10 p.m., which is going to be pretty awesome with my friend Cynthia. So, yeah, it's going to be pretty awesome. And I don't know if I'm going to let him out again. I definitely won't vlog because... It's like, if I need to handle him, then I'm, I'm gonna handle him. So, like, I'm not afraid to stick my hands in when two dogs are fighting, because I've done it with my dogs. And I've gotten bitten on my arm and my leg, but I got it. And I want to let him go again, but he's too crazy. Um, I don't know, I'm gonna have to talk to his owner, see if... To tell him that this might be... That he probably shouldn't take him to a dog park anytime soon until he settles down because he's still a puppy and he has a lot of energy and he wants to run and push and jump and other dogs sometimes don't want to do that and they get angry surfer okay i got a handle so i'll talk to you guys in a bit hopefully you can hear me hopefully this is good quality hopefully this is better than my phone so oh that's why i love this ipod thank you steve jobs oh and the reason i'm recording with my ipod is because my dumbass forgot the memory card for my camera so yeah there's that I am definitely the most hipster I could possibly look right now. Riding a bike, wearing this knit cap the way I'm wearing it, the wear first style sunglasses and the chucks. Um, it was a tough day with Surfer, but oh, the wind. Doing my best to cover the wind. I hope that helps. Whoop. Okay. Hopefully that helps. Um, it was. It was tough. But he was a, his owner was asleep and sick, so I didn't want to tell him today. Tell him tomorrow if he's awake or there. But uh, Surfer's definitely a little afraid of me now. Um, I guess he kind of like thought he could take advantage of me before today. And he would always like, he almost never listened to me. And then today, I, I like buckled down, I was aggressive. I was like, Surfer, you know, easy, and I pulled him and... I pulled him and got him to calm down, and he he was definitely afraid of me on the way home. Uh, I don't know if that's a bad thing or a good thing, but actually I think that's a good thing because I didn't hit him or anything like that, if that's what you're thinking, but I was aggressive. Um, I just like was straight up honest with him and like just like got him to focus on me, which was good, and now he's not afraid of me. and. That is definitely good because now he knows that he can't just like do whatever he wants when I'm walking him. So hopefully if I do take him to the park again, hopefully next time he's a little more obedient. And hopefully he's not as aggressive. Um, I don't know when that will be, but we'll see. I'm definitely going to have to talk to his owner about it though. But now I'm going to go do some high school stuff um, that I need to get done and stop procrastinating. And those of you who have been with me for a while know what I'm talking about when I say high school stuff. There's only one thing, and it's not at my old high school, so you won't be seeing my old high school. It's at an adult school, and that should give you guys more of a hint. So, I have to go take care of that, some of that stuff now. And, uh, yeah, 
so I'm gonna listen to my iPod and I won't be able to record until later so until I tell you guys how it went hopefully it went so that I can tell you and so that I can stop procrastinating so see you guys later I just saw an opportunity for a really nice photo but there's no memory card so I'm gonna have to take a video still hopefully it doesn't turn out bad There goes one. How do we get another one? Two. Okay. That should be it. Now I'm here at the school. I passed it without even knowing, and I went too far that way. What an idiot. Welcome to Wednesday's show. Not really a show. <clears throat> More of an attempt of me trying to be funny five days a week. Now today's Wednesday, which means it's Challenge Katia Wednesday, and there's something on the lens. Um, something you want to see me do. So you challenge me. You have to tell me in the comments. This... <laughs> it's not my elbow. <laughs> Alright, so I'm back with my camera. Feels good. Um, watching Twilight. Uh, first one. Um, it was playing on television, so I thought I'd watch it. Uh, I'm excited to see the last one. Or the first part of the last one. I'm not like a huge crazy fan. I just... I'm a fan. I'm just a fan. Oh, I forgot to take my application. Dang. But, um, yeah, everything. I got home. I ate. I was hungry. I ate. I'm feeling nice and stuffed. No, not really. I'm not stuffed. But, you know, I'm satisfied, which is good. And... Yeah, I guess hopefully all the footage from my iPod is good. If not, then this is all I'm getting and I'm screwed for yet for today. But, yeah, actually I didn't even realize that Surfer scratched me pretty hard. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. But, yeah, I didn't even realize that until, like, way later. But, yeah, I don't know. It's been an interesting day today. Uh, if the footage from the iPod's not that bad, I might use it more often because... It's so small and easy to carry around. And if it's better quality than this camera, then I'm probably going to be using it to vlog. Especially because I have so much memory on that thing. So, we'll see. We'll see. I really never had to use a camera before. But this was like, it's a good, like, it's a good backup in case I, in case the batteries ever die on this. Or, or I forget the memory card like I did. And, uh, or if I get the camera, the whole camera in general. That is not bad to use. Uh, if the footage comes out well, I need to check it out. But, yeah, so I'm excited for Friday to go watch the movie. Uh, watch the last one with Jessica and my friend Cynthia. And, yeah, I'm just excited to hang out with people. So, yeah. Oh, and interesting thing. I have to leave the TV on so that Fluffy can hear the noise outside because she, she freaks out when she's alone. And she thought my parents because my parents were in here watching their their uh, novellas and she thought that nobody was home so she started freaking out so I had to turn on the TV so that she wouldn't freak out and now she's all calm so I don't know that does on crack that's gonna be the title of this video dogs on crack oh I just shot a challenge me video um I tried licking my elbows so oh well you just saw the behind the scenes Durr, Katia. that's it for today I guess um case and TV go check it out first link in the panties I'm gonna finish editing this video for tonight because it has to go up tonight. Okay, check this out. Let me put the volume down. Whoops. There we go. Okay, real quick. Um, see this jacket that I'm currently wearing? I bought it a while back, uh, last summer actually, and um, after a while it didn't fit. My arms, like, because I gained some weight, my arms got big and I could this is the highest I could lift up my arms honestly because they will get super tight around here and if you look closely you can still see it's kind of tight but remember I said this is about as high as I can lift up my arms and now it's like that's how much higher I can lift my arms which means that I'm fitting better into my clothes which is awesome and these jeans that I'm wearing right now are super saggy but that is so great I'm fitting into my clothes better and I'm so excited that my weight loss is finally going the way I want it to go, which is amazing. So, yeah. Okay, that was it. I just wanted to tell you guys that. Okay, good night for real this time. Uh, bye.